Hello, it's Sarah, and this video is to officially announce that my Etsy store is open. I have about 30 things listed at the moment, and I just wanted to go over what I have. I will be adding more things and definitely painted items um, and more of the same. But for right now, I just wanted to go over, and you've seen some of these pieces in my resin shares already, but I wanted to just show you what is actually listed. I have six of my light switch, uh, switch plates listed. And in the beginning, I had them all under one heading and it didn't work. Um, someone suggested I do that because then it's not like separate listings, but I was having trouble with getting them, um, oh, my light's flickering. Um, getting them to like sell out or, or show a number or it was just weird for me. So I ended up listing everything separately. So they all have a separate listing now. Um, I have this bug one, which is really cute. It has the, the FEMO um, little, uh, what are they called? The slices in there of the flowers. The bug one. I have the surfer girl. I really only wanted to put things up that I feel are very good quality because some of my piece, some of them I did that they weren't as good of quality. So. Um, all of these fit on my light switch plates. They fit up on the wall. I tried them all and um, they're all ready to go. So this one's just some cupcakes with some candy in the background and glitter in the background. Um, I just added this astronaut one. I think it's super cute. I don't even know if little boys want to be, or girls, want to be astronauts anymore. <laughs> it's probably something from back when I was a little kid, but it turned out cute. Um, the ladybug. I like that one too. They're just really simple. Then this was one of my first ones when I was trying to be really fancy. And I will be doing the Rockstar again. I just think it's kind of a really nice novelty item. Um, and I'll try it. I did um, red and white glitter stripes on the back. I might just try it with plain white or plain red or something. So we'll see. I, kind of, I like the stripes though. So that turned up cute. And then I'm going to be adding the pirate. I just finished this pirate one and haven't listed it yet, but I drilled it and um, glazed it and it's all ready to go. So there'll be seven and those are selling for $10. So those are on my store. Then I have, these are polymer clay pendants that I made and I'm calling these screwed heart pendants. And it's just a clay heart that I kind of twisted the bottom and put, these are actual deck screws from our deck when we were building our deck. And there's like a bead for an eye. So these are called screwed heart pendants. And I have two of those on my shop right now, two for sale. And those are $10 as well. Um, I have some clay applique pendants up there. I have three at the moment and they're three of my bigger ones. And I showed you these in my, um, when I had my shares. So there's three and these are all the two inch by, you know, I think two by one, I would say. So there's this one. If you go on my Etsy store, there's very clear pictures and they come with the chain. I didn't have 22 inches of chain for this one. So I figured whichever one, like if I sold this one, that one of those chains will go on there and then I'll figure it out as I go. But um, I have three of those available. And then I have three of my applique boxes. I have three of the, I did the heart, this rectangle was just added, and the oval. One says love, love, and hope. So I have three of those. Those are the little ones. Those are on there. And those are actually $23 a piece. And I'll have to see what, if, what people think of the prices. If, I mean, because it's a handmade item and uh, not everyone can do that. And so it's, it's, I feel the value is there, but you know, I do want to sell them as well. So I think it'll have to be like a happy medium. I'll have to figure out my pricing as I go. Um, then I have two Sugar Skull keychains up at the moment. And these are the ones that I did, um, I think, oh, they're both different. This one has the blue glitter background and I put that in the description. The descriptions are very detailed. Um, this one has a white skull with a, uh, with a feather dangle at the bottom and it has the cross and it has the blue glitter and then the blue to match. 
And then this one is one of the mirrored ones. This has, um, this is one of the ones that I poured in all white and embedded a mirror on the back. So um, I made that into a keychain. It has a red, oh, a white skull with red, red um, beads. And the mirror, and then I just colored the side. And it has a red keychain um, on the top. And those are $10. Then I have the Sugar Skull necklaces. I have three of the gold tone, and these are all listed separately now because I know I had I sold one and people were having trouble getting them to to show the color and the right. I think these are listed separately, are they? I don't th I think this one might be the one that's not listed separately, but it's definitely clearly to find um, the colors. It's either purple, red, or red and gold. This one's a red and gold because it has red glitter in the back, and these both have purple. Um, and then I fully described the bead, um, well not fully, but the, the, there's a section of beadwork attached to a gold tone chain. So those are my three gold tone ones, and then I have two silver tone ones, and I love these. I love these so much. Um, these also have the mirror embedded in the back. I have a cross, both of them have dangle crosses on the bottom. The cross one and the heart one. This is the one I did for my tutorial when I did the painting tutorial. Um, and they both have sections of beads, which I love. I just think the beads are so pretty. And then this one, I kept one very similar to this that I have. So I have two of those in my shop. And all of the um, Sugar Skull keychains are going for, oh no, the keychains are 10. And the Sugar Skull necklaces, I don't, yes I do. They're 20 because you know, the beading, these beads, some of the beads, the furnace glass are more expensive. So some of this stuff is a little more expensive for me to just have um, than the work involved. And um, uh, so I just thought that was a fair price. I have my purse charms and I didn't bring them in here. Um, they're hanging in the other room, um, but they're up there as well. Um, and then I have my resin plaques. So I showed these in my resin share. They ha I finished them. They're all done. They have, I, put, I attached a tooth hanger to the back of them. And I have Army, Navy, and Air Force, three of those. I put feet. I ran out of feet on the one, but the other two have rubber feet on the back. This one, the coaster, I just left plain. That's, I think that's $10. And then the, the big plaques are 18. These are going for 18. So I have Army, Navy, and Air Force. And that is it. I have lots of ideas, so keep, keep checking. And let me know if there's anything you'd like to see in my store. I'd be happy to give it a shot, okay? I'm going to look into doing some um, paper crafts as well, some mini albums and things like that. So... Oh, also, I may be having a giveaway. I have no idea how to do a giveaway or what I need to do to do a giveaway, but it was suggested to me by one of my subbies, Lisa Houston. I think it's a great idea. I'm about at 2,000 subbies, and I think that's a really great time to do a giveaway, and I have lots of great stuff I could give away. I just don't know how to go about it, so maybe if you guys um, can direct me, I'm going to YouTube it and look into what other people have done, so... I'm sure I'll figure it out. So look forward to that. And you guys, thank you all so much for watching my videos. And um, I really do appreciate my YouTube family. Um, so go over to my store and check it out. All right, you guys. Thanks so much for watching.